Hello, welcome back Crusaders. So today we are hunting down some missing Crusaders. Scouts, I think it was. Uh, yeah, this one here. Scout the ravines southwest of Dresden or send a scouting party. So find out how the demons are sneaking into Crusader territory. So, and we were heading towards, I can't see the world map. Oh yeah, I can. No, I can't. Okay. So I can't see the world map from here, but this was a random encounter. Ah, these look like demon cultists to me. Quick, tie them up. It's the Crusaders. The Crusaders are here. The Crescent of the Abyss must be informed. Well, that was rude of you. I certainly hope you're all ready to die painfully. Yeah, I'm pretty sure these guys just die now. Yep. Well, for a bunch of cultists, that went about how you might expect. Just take- oh, we're getting magical glaives now. Okay, was well, that it? Just a bunch of cultists? What about down here? Nothing down there? So it's either Winter Sun... Or Nameless Ru nope, not Nameless Ruins. Alright, so I think it's Winter Sun we're heading out to. Shrine of Sacrilege. I think it kind of behooves us to check out this Shrine of Sacrilege. Oh, we can't, though. Enemy fort blocks the way. Oh, that's unfortunate. All right. Hello, underground Your hideout. Orders, Commander. Uh, saddle up on Bismuth, Regil. That is my order. All right, let's grab some restorations on Regil. All right, so we used up all of Sociel's restorations. The only one who has negative levels at this point is Sociel, and he is missing two ne uh He has two negative levels. So, that's the best we can do until our next rest. Let's go ahead and grab some long-term buffs. My False Grace. That's a pretty good one. There we go. So everyone's got false grace, so that's a good 38, 40. They got really good rolls. So between, like, you know, upper 20s, upper 30s, temporary hit points. Ah, there's a, a masterwork dagger sticking out of this strung up man. Hmm. I see loot down there. Okay, that's the edge of the map. That is also the edge of the map. Ah. Oh, what do we have here? A gored corpse. The body is covered in terrible wounds. It's clear they were left not by an animal's teeth, but by a skillful torturer's hand. Very right, well, let's be careful in this little... Crevasse. Aha, uh -huh. we have traps. All right, Melandrius, go ahead, disarm that trap, please. Oh, did you Thank you. See that? And what do we have? Some magic essence. Uh, let's move carefully. A stranger. Hmm. We'll speak with this stranger after we explore this cave. All right, cave. Seems we have some glowing mushrooms. A brazier. Ah, an incubus. I see blood. Blood. Ah. What do we have here? Oh, it's, uh, aforementioned incubus. Right. Very well, Melendrius. Good sneak attack. And. Do these guys have spell resistance? 17. Negligible. Alright. Well, let's go ahead and just ma magic missile this guy. That is pretty good damage. I'll just come over here and nope, take care of that. 
Ah. All right. Well, let's go ahead and see invisibility. There's another one. Found you. All right, Arushale. Three damage. Ah, it tells you right here. Oh, that is very nice. It shows you the damage reduction right here. Good or cold iron. All right. Well, let's get some aligned weapons going on then. Steel Vanguard, go up there, do just, you know, block attacks and whatnot. Uh, where is a line weapon? Right here. A line weapon, good. Hmm, Arushalea. As Melandrius' sneak attacks kind of don't really matter all that much. Like, what's minus 10 damage when you're sneak attacking for, like, 40, right? Um, hmm. I think we just go with a regular old haste. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. I like that. <laughs> so, Melandrius got his level up, and of course I gave him Opportunist, right? So, and because he has Opportunist and a whole bunch of extra- Oh, speaking of which, I've got boots here that'll give him an extra attack of opportunity per round. So, now he's got something like six attacks of opportunity per round, I want to say. That stacked with Opportunist. Yeah, yeah. So if my melee characters all gang up on like one person, Belandrius should have many attacks of opportunity per round for every landed uh, melee hit. And I am looking forward to seeing that pay off pretty well. Disarm this trap. Right. I like how we spotted this trap all the way up here. Uh, I'm guessing more incubus. Nothing, just the trap. Alrighty. What's over? Ah! Oh, will o wisps. I'm guessing these are will o wisps. Yes, they are will o wisps. Miss due to concealment. Okay. Uh, permanent invisibility. Interesting. I think Melendris has blind fight. I believe so. Let the attack commence. Hmm, that didn't trigger an attack of opportunity. Is that because he's not actually engaged? I wonder. Immunities. Spell immunity. Right, 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 right. Uh, they are vulnerable to magic missiles, so I guess we'll just do that. There you go. Have a, have a magic missile. And so long, Will-O-Wisp number one. Um, so seal. Let's go ahead and use a resist electricity communal. Regal. Um, hmm. Can we slumber it? We can, but it succeeded. Oh, there's another one. Oh, goodbye. Oh, and another one. Oh, these guys are just coming out of the woodworks. Why are you not getting... Is that because he needed a move action? Probably. Why is an opportunist working? Like, that was a confirmed hit. Melandrius is in threat range. But he didn't get the opportunist perk. Like, pop. Here, just... Magic missile this guy. Goodbye. 
Uh, what else can we use here? A bless? Yeah, sure, why not? Hmm. There's some interesting things going on here. I don't understand why the opportunist perk wasn't, uh, wasn't proccing there. Very strange. Alright, looks like we've got another incubus. Oh, it looks like we have a few of them. Oh, yeah. A vine trap. Well, alright. Uh, let's see, who is it? Go ahead and grab uh, Selective Grease. Say hello to the ground. Ember. Fire Snake could be good here. Mm. Shivial the Pain Connoisseur. Well, maybe if we can get Ember, like, over here. Yeah, there we go. Wow. Fire Snake did some good damage. All right, Melandris. Uh, yeah, let's just die, die, die. take care of that guy there real quick. Now, nah, Bismuth is down. Let's see, Skeletal Vanguard. Yeah, just finish up that guy. All right, Arushale. Yeah, make sure that's off. Uh, can you hit this guy? No. All right, well, I'll just hit this guy then. That was very underwhelming. Gil, stand up. Wake up. Uh, let's see. All right, so seal. Let's grab a protection from evil communal. Ah, there we go. Righteous Might. I have one of those, too. Uh, let's see. We already greased. Are we hasted? No, we are not hasted. Okay. Uh, then let's grab Siphon Time. Make sure this can hit everyone. Okay, so we'll probably slow two of these guys. Uh, this one's saved, this one's slow. But we're all hasted. One of them slowed. And maybe I can get Ember. Eh, he's nowhere close. Hmm. Maybe just a Scorching Ray instead. Yeah, they were just Scorching Ray. Yeah, good stuff, Ember. Good stuff. Uh, Melendrius stabbed this guy. See, what I don't understand is how you don't get a sneak attack if they're prone on the ground. Like, how does that not qualify for a sneak attack? Very strange, if you ask me. Uh, oh, did this guy go invisible? Probably. All right, Regil. Good stuff. Uh, let's see. What else can we use here? Uh, she has a lion weapon. Let's drop an align weapon on Regil. There we go. And then we can, like, align weapon Melandrius. Oh, there he is. Shivial the Pain Connoisseur. Let's take a look at this guy. Uh, outflank. Doesn't really do him any good when all of his uh, little cronies are dead. Uh, what has he got? 19 hit die. Freedom of movement permanent. Resist fire permanent. Doesn't really matter because she has ascendant element. 
Um, 28 AC. Damage reduction, exception good. That's why I'm getting a line weapon on everyone. Uh, immunities, poison, movement impairing. Yeah, and he's got freedom of movement, so ceasing is, is going to be rather difficult. I think we'll be fine, though. What if I just exsanguinate him? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we just exsanguinate him. Saving throw succeeded. Doesn't really matter, because I'm still doing 13d6 damage to the guy. And it's unholy damage, so there's like nobody with unholy resist. Or very, very few people anyway. Very few people that I've seen. 15d6. DC 20. You know what? I'm pretty sure we just evil eye this guy. Let's evil eye his, um. Let's evil eye his AC. Uh, that's good enough. Make sure we're in range for Cackle next round. Uh, Melandrius. You know what? I'm actually going to delay Melandrius until after Regil. Because I want him to get all of his sneak attacks off. Let's make sure we're in point blank range. I will resist. Ooh. Did she just crit for 48? Very nice. Okay, Regil. Uh, let's go ahead and smite Chaos here. Uh, there we go. This dude's toast. He doesn't stand a chance. Uh, let's see. You know what? I am so confident I'm even going to send you in. Yeah. Oh, he did get a sneak attack. Did you see that? The Landrius makes attack of opportunity. I think there's some weird behind the scenes stuff going on for opportunist. Oh no. Not my skeletal vanguard. Whatever will I do? You're getting exsanguinated for that though. Rest in peace. All right, well, let's grab some loot. Got some masterworks. Uh, Cloak resistance two. Physical flow. What is that? Strength and dexterity. Okay. Uh, chain mail of camaraderie. This is, a, this is a plus three mithril chain mail. Whenever the wearer blinks an enemy, the wearer gets a plus two damage bonus against the flank creature. If you have outflank, the damage bonus in increases to plus four. Oh, well, that's pretty good. I wonder if that would be of any use for Melendris here, if that's actually... Oh, no, you can't even use it. Unfortunate. Uh, let's see, who's got the highest lore nature? 14 on Regil. Alright, so it looks like Regil has the highest lore nature. So, welcome Regil, you get a shirt. Very nice. And now your Lord Nature should be... Yeah, plus 19. Yeah, that's so good. No, oh, speaking of Lord Nature, we have a Lord Nature check right here. I will learn from this mistake. You rolled a... S wait, 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 wait. Perception? You rolled a natural one. Wow, that is so unlucky. So unlucky. Oh well. No secrets can escape my prying gaze. All right, loot. Some sort of ring. Righteous Crusader's ring. If the wearer of this ring has the Smite Evil class ability, this ring grants them one additional use of it per day after resting. Oh, and a demonic heart. Okay. So does this work with Regil's Smite Chaos? Well, let's find out. Uh, after resting. So we'll see if this goes up to three or not after we rest. Oh, well. I guess the real loot here was... Oh, hey, an Iron Maiden. 
Ah, look at that. Ah, that's an Iron Maiden, all right. So I don't think there was nothing over here, right? Nah. Well, we didn't really find anything. We found a pretty cool ring, and if it works with Regil's Smite Chaos, that'll be, uh... That'll be super cool. I don't think it will, because it specifically states, you know, Smite Evil, not Smite Chaos. But maybe we'll get lucky. All right, so we are at the Shrine of Sacrilege. Um, because I'm still waiting for that demon army to... Hello, wolf. So I'm still waiting for that demon army to uh, be dealt with by my automatic crusade. Plagued wolf. All right, plagued wolf. Let's, uh, let's not have you guys plague my people. That would be, that would be awesome. So we'll just hang out and wait for them to come to us. Go ahead and throw a bless on everyone. Ah, uh, delay poison communal would have been better. Whoops. My mistake. Let's turn that off. Oh. Okay. All right. Never mind. I didn't realize they were that weak. Yeah, my mistake. <laughs> I was expecting, you know, encounters to be roughly near our, you know, level, not two hit point wolves and stuff. Why is Bismuth and the Skeletal Vanguard, why do they have, like, no HP? One. One. Very strange. Yeah. Uh, if that's all there is here, we should sweep through this area pretty quickly. Oh, we've got Babaos. All right. Uh, glory to the Great Titans. That is a lot of Babaos. Landrius. Big sneak head. attack. I don't know what just hit there. I, ju I, ju I have no idea what just happened. Prepare yourself. That is a lot of babows. Uh, let's see. What would be good here? What would be best here? Maybe just like a prayer? Mm, that's not really going to hit any of them. Are we already blessed? Yeah, we're blessed. Okay. I like a uh, protection from evil communal. Yeah, let's get up here. Yeah, we'll use this evil protection communal. Uh, controlled fireball. Yeah, controlled fireball. Good damage. Skeletal Vanguard. Yeah, just go soak up an attack or two. That's fine. Uh, let's see. Do I have any good AoE? Um, Acid Fog. Siphon Time could be good. That'll hit everyone right there. Uh, I see, like, one will save. Yeah, the warrior made his will save. All these other guys are slowed now. Yeah, that's pretty good. I'll take that. Look how slow he is. Uh, Melandrius. Um, now yeah, come over here. Start working on these guys. Uh, get up, Regil. Yep, that's fine. Ow. Uh, let's see. Let's start working on this warrior here. Or you can roll three ones in a row. You know, that's fine. Look how slow he is. <laughs> uh, let's see. He's kind of getting low there. I don't really want to use 
that just yet, though. Uh, here's a good spot for a prayer. Yeah, there we go. It looks like you two made saves. Spell resistance. Uh, okay. Uh, controlled fireball. Good damage. These guys should all be coming down, like, next turn or so. Skeletal Vanguard... Um... Yeah, start working on these guys. Do I have any, like, AoE damage spells? Like, Siphon Time is great. False Grace is also really good. There we go. I'll use that. All right, Melendrus. May I see your entrails, please? This one's mine. Yeah, the rest of these guys are just toast. Oh, that was a lot of babows. Interesting how the Babao Warrior didn't have a spear, it just had, you know, like, an eyeball. Uh, let's saddle up. Uh, looks like we have another cave. Let's finish exploring the outside before we go in that cave, though. Oh, that's a uh, area exit. I think... A little hidden loot. What do we have? A bunch of junk, 300 gold. Not bad, not great, but you know, not bad. A magic light shield plus one, and a cold iron masterwork longsword. Another 200 gold right there. Let's go check out this cave. Now that everyone's more or less healed up, we'll go check out this cave. Cave of Wonder. Oh, well, it looks like the Cave of Babows. All right, three Babaos, one Babao warrior. Aha. Uh -huh. All right, well, let's make sure Socio Melandrius don't proc this trap here. Uh, all right, Ember, I want you back here. Oh, that's a lot of them, isn't it? All right, uh, let's see. That looks pretty good. A little fire snake there. Nice damage. Uh, so seal. Burst of glory. Uh, Melendra. Ah, very nice. Yeah, Babao Warrior. Alright, so Melandra's got one attack of opportunity there. I was expecting it to proc more. That or he just wasn't in range of this warrior here. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna keep an eye on it to see just how often it happens. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Oh. Oh, that was cool. All right, bone explosions really neat. I did, I did, you know, like blast my skeletal vanguard and bismuth and so seal too but uh, oh and regal <laughs> okay if i could get that to be like um what's the uh what's the meta magic selective yeah so like a selective bone explosion could be really good and then maybe I'll get like the the feet um, favored meta magic, where it reduces the um, the level by one, so it stays level five instead of taking a level six slot. That could be good. I'm pretty sure I did. More. Oh, but we had uh, we had the false grace on, so I pretty much just blasted through their false grace. <laughs> oh. I have no regrets. That was still super cool. All right, Melendris, let's uh, let's disarm some of these traps. 
did it. I did it. Uh, yeah, just a bunch of... Just a bunch of spears. Oh! Alright, what's hold? Okay, well, let's have you sneak over here. I don't think I really need to, but just in case, you never know. Maybe some invisible demons or something. What do we have up here? Oh, hello! A voracious Glabrezu. Right, right. Well, let's grab, a, let's grab a couple of these, top everyone off. And... Where are my bubble buffs? Ah... Uh, ah... Uh, I see, okay. Yeah, I've got to update all of my mods because we're on, um... Like 2.0 or something. Oh, that means I'm gonna have to spend five minutes buffing everyone. All right, give me a second. Uh, let's grab another false grace. Grab a bone shield. Uh, I like siphon time, but I think I might just use a regular haste. Yeah. All right, Mr. Glubrezu, I imagine you have good. Yep, DR-10 good. So let's uh, let's throw on some aligned weapons of good. All right, there we go. That should be enough buffs for this. Oh, and Melendrius got the first turn. Okay, let's go ahead and summon our fallen friend here. There we are. Uh, we'll just start Evil Eye this guy. There we go. Evil Eye, your AC. And do you have Divine Favor? No. All right, let's go ahead and grab Divine Favor. Uh, can you bit of luck hurt? No, you can't. Okay, unfortunate. Is what is though. Oh, I forgot to give her her buffs. Oh well. Let's just go ahead and hurricane bow. Desna, guide my hand. Uh, let's delay you to about there. Let's see, got any good spells for this guy? Siphon time. No, we're already haste. So I don't really need to do that. Uh, let's see. We're uh, we have false grace. I've got bone shield. Could communal stone skin? Could could. I think I'll just exsanguinate him though. Honestly. Yeah. 44 damage. He did make his fortitude save. That's fine. Bunch of babows. Uh, let's see. Uh, I would like to make sure that you are in cackle range. Evil Eye AC. Evil Eye saving throw? Uh, nah. Evil Eye attack rolls. Uh, absolutely attack rolls. There we go. Hmm. Anything else we can use? Breath of Life, True Sing, Freedom of Movement, Divine Power. Yeah, Divine Power. There we go. Jeez, 63. Wowie. Alright, not bad, not bad. Get up here, Bismuth. Ah, I should have smited him. Smote? Smited? Yeah, I didn't expect the Vanguard to really do anything there. I'm pretty sure the Glabrez is just dead. Yeah, he's just dead. Maybe I overbuffed. Or maybe there's another one. Hello, sir. Alright, where is... I need to set up the second hotbar here. All my mods got outdated because of the update. Uh, where is my dispel magic? Here we go. Uh, dispel magic target. Here we go. See if we can't dispel his mirror image. And we did. Goodbye, mirror image. Hope you uh, had fun having that for all of one round.
Ember. Uh, same as before. Let's go ahead, Evil Eye. Do a little cackle. Uh, so Seal. Archon Zora. Nice, these guys are affected by it. The Babaos, all... Th Babaos failed their throws. Very good. And let's see. Uh, aspect to the Falcon. Yeah. Make your peace. Crit for 50 damage. Uh, let's see. I think the Skeletal Vanguard will be best served you against these Babaos. Uh, Melendris, let's get up here. You missed. That's unfortunate. Oh, wow. Okay. Goodbye, Skeletal Vanguard. It was nice knowing you, friend. All right, well, let's just grab an Exanguinate. Let's throw this on the hot bar. That's going to be a main spell. Bone explosion. I really need selective for this to be like any good at all. Unless I just don't care about my frontliners. <laughs> Nah, we're gonna exanguinate though. Here, have an exanguinate, friend. 55 damage minus 6 strength. Ouch. Even for a Gilbrezzi, that's gotta hurt. So it went from having 29 strength to. Oh, and he's bleeding. Permanent bleed. Two D six bleed damage permanently. Wow. Two D six damage every turn. That is wild. Exanguinate is such a good spell, and it ignores um, spell resistance. All right, Ember. Uh, why don't we go ahead and evil eye's attack rolls? There we go. Do a little cackle. Yeah, as Evil Eye AC and attack rolls. Uh, so Seal, let's go ahead and take out these Babaos. Ah, uh, so close. Yep, that guy's just just gone. Just goodbye. Retreat is not an option. Wow. Blabrezus, you gonna need to send something stronger after me. Uh, what about that loot? What is that? Cold Iron Masterwork Greatsword. And a couple of scrolls. Firestorm. Now, I wonder if Ember uses, like, a scroll of Firestorm. I wonder if that would apply her, uh... Ascendant Element. Oh, goodbye. Oh. Wow. Arushale failed a perception check. She rolled a three. That is unfortunate. Oh, someone saw it. Okay, it must have been that trap there. All right. I don't think we've missed any side paths. Yeah, I think we just kind of go across this little bridge thing here. Uh, right, my Skeletal Vanguard is dead. So we're just using Bismuth and Regil as our frontliners now. I don't really think we need to worry too much. Uh, hello. Okay, never mind. Worrying, worrying. 21 hit die. Okay. Full strength, bears endurance, 38 strength on this monster. 28 spell resistance, doesn't really matter. Blitz cut, four attacks. Three attacks on the short sword and a bite. So, you know, just a casual eight attacks per round with a 21 bab. He can dispel magic. Thanatotic's God Slayer. Interesting. 
All right. Well, he doesn't have freedom of movement. He does have 18 reflex, though. All right. Okay, then. What buffs do you have on you, Socio? Archon's Aura, Angelic Aspect. You still have negative levels. Going to need... Going to need uh, some buffs, I do believe. They resist energy. Alright, so let's go ahead and get a good aligned weapon on him. And then we may need... I think everyone's using a magic weapon, so I don't really think we'll need that. We have one... No, that's a regular protection from evil. And our protection from evil has worn off. Unfortunate. Okay. Gormandizir. Um. Alright, I do not want this guy to get flanking bonuses, so we are actually... We're gonna take out the Babaos first. Oh, no, oh, Melandris. Oh, that's not where you want to be, my guy. Okay. Uh, can we get lucky and slumber this guy? Nope. Let's go ahead and evil eye his savings throws first. All right. Step up. So he's in cackle range. All right. Melendrius. Um, mm, we may want to give him a distraction. Actually, communal stone skin could be pretty good. Yeah, yeah, I think we use communal stone skin here. All right, so everyone's got stone skin now. That's going to be big. And we all still have our false grace on. All right, we do not want this guy to get flanking bonuses. Uh, actually, a shoot order the God Claw. Yeah, this guy's chaotic, right? Yeah, and we're going to smite this guy as well. And try and put ourselves in front of Melend. Oh, and a Glibrezu as well. Of course. Fantastic. Okay. All right, Arushale. Uh, what buffs do you have? You have Hurricane Bow, Aspect of the Falcon. Go ahead and grab Sense of Vitals and step up in point blank range. Oh, that is a big boy. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, that is a large lad. In awe at the size of that lad. Okay. All right, Arushale. I will resist. There we go. And she has cleaving shot, so that'll do just a little bit of damage. I'm going to try and... Uh, I don't... I think dispelling these guys is a waste of time, honestly. So I'm not going to worry about that. Ooh, ouch. Oh... Uh, well, that took out his false grace. All right, so Seal, what can you do here? What can you do here, my friend? Hmm. We still have Bless on. Yeah, we do, for another minute. Divine Favor. And bit of luck. Yeah, a bit of luck on Melandris. Oh, and he's down. Good lord. I don't I don't know if I don't think I was ready for this. Um cure critical. Yes. Oh, I didn't cackle. Oh my god, I'm so bad. Uh all right. Distractions. We need distractions. We need CC. All right. It's a, it's, it's slim, but let's try a grease. Slim shot. This actually works. Oh, oh my God. Mordecai, you are a legend. You are a legend. Greased both of the Glibrezi right there. Okay. All right, just start working on this guy. You're at one HP. Okay. All right. It's uh, let's focus down Gormandizer. Socio. 
Uh, where's Breath of Life? Where is Breath of Life? Here it is. Breath of Life. Melandrius. You failed your concentration check, you. Ugh. I've never been more disappointed in my life. All right, one of them is back up. Regil is down. I mean, he can't die, so that's that's fortunate. Cure critical. All right, we need more CC. So we greased. Maybe we try a web. Is this my... Here's my selective web. All right. So we'll selective web these guys too. All right. So the Glabrezu are webbed. Oh my god. Okay. Prepare yourself. Not getting a lot of good hits. Okay. Well, Breath of Life didn't work. I don't have any diamonds. Let's try scrolls. Oh, the tankard of free spirit. The tankard of free spirit. Yes, start summoning, start summoning. All right, Regil is dead. We are out of frontliners. Um, let's evil eye his savings throws. Okay, uh, we already used the summon fallen. Hungry pit. Can I get the Glabrezus in the hungry pit and avoid... Uh, it's so hard to see. Alright, let's try that. Um, are the I think the Glabrezu are too big for the Hungry Pit to work. Uh, okay, that may have been a mistake. Maybe we can get a Lucky Blind? If we can get a Lucky Blind on this guy, that'll be amazing. Nope, Spell Resistance. I didn't think so. It was worth a shot, though. He's in the pit. He is in the pit. Oh my god. Okay, this is huge. Uh, now we can work on the Glabrezu. Actually, actually huge. I should have protective lucked them. Oh, I'm so bad. All right. Control fireball. 36. Okay, that's good. That was like 50 damage right there. Um, Exanguinate. Ooh. You felt that. All right, let's go ahead and grab a Cat's Grace on her. So seal, heal. Yes. Grapple against Mordecai. Oh, because it's webbed. It's webbed. Uh, that dude's in the pit. Fantastic. Another control fireball. 36 and spell resistance on the other one. Uh, exanguinate. Focus this guy down. Ah, oh, he is toast. He's dead. Arushale finish this guy off. Good stuff. Let's see, so seal. Our bless is still on for like a few more rounds. Oh, you actually did damage. Oh, that's incredible. Of course you're gonna sound burst. I swear to God, the AI. He's still in the pit. Um, let's see. Fire snake. Uh, touch might actually be pretty good. Yeah, there we go. And guess what? We're going to have another exanguinate. Goodbye. 
And now we just kind of wait, put real time on, because this guy's just chilling in the pit. Okay, he's back. And he immediately gets greased. Guess what? Have an exanguinate. 52 damage, minus one strength. Oh, you are done for. Be gone, fiend! Yeah, all right. Fair enough. Uh, let's go ahead and evil eye your savings throws. Keep you on the ground. Oh, he's back in the pit. He's back in the pit. Yeah, back in the pit you go. Oh, and he's back out. Have another exanguinate, sir. Oh, you are so done for. Now, Ruchelet, finish him off, please. Fantastic. Wow. Wow, I was not prepared. I was not ready for that. All right, let's go ahead and dismiss, like, all of our spells. That's the first time I used the, uh, the Hungry Pit spell, and wow, that came in clutch, didn't it? Now, this guy better have some incredible stuff. The Litz Cut is a short sword, a plus three shock. This plus three shock short sword, short sword, bypasses any type of damage reduction. Wow, okay, that's huge. That's really good. And what is that? Plus two short, short sword, uh, plus two breastplate. All right. Well, let's finish up the rest of this. Hello, demon blood. Oh, the sun is right in my eye. All right, that should help. Put that right there. Uh, another short sword plus two. Here, give me the rest of that. I'm taking all of it. What is this? Hello? These symbols... This looks very familiar. Like that, that first puzzle dungeon that we went to, you remember? Aha! Uh -huh. Ah, just random loot. Well... Well, I would say that was a better boss fight than, you know, the end of Dresden. <laughs> so didn't really, uh, that was, uh, that was quite the battle. I've got to say that was, that was a better boss fight than, uh, than the end of Dresden, honestly. Um, Un unfortunate about Regil and Mordecai here, but we've got some scrolls of Raised Dead, so we'll bring them back. Uh, yeah, that was pretty great. Um, didn't really finish my quest objective, but I think it was some pretty solid exploring. Some, some solid, uh, solid demon hunting there. Just clearing up the riffraff from the, uh, from the area. So we'll try and find those guys, the the lost crusaders uh, tomorrow or, you know, whenever I get around to the next episode. Regardless, thank you for joining me today. My name is Vanathan. I appreciate your time and I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.